Holy fuck! My, uh, my Twitter account is, uh, blowing the hell up right now. Apparently, uh, a couple of, uh, internet personalities retweeted that silly little fortune thing I made months ago. And, uh, I am getting, like, heaps and heaps of retweets on it. Hey, 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 I'm back again. Children of Mana. It's here. Yet again. We're almost done with this game. We have two more main dungeons, and I think, like, three side quests, and then we have all the elemental side quests in the post-game, which aren't supposed to be post-game, but apparently they are. I don't, I don't know how it works. quest guide for this. Uh, I think there was one more that I could do now that I didn't get to do. Uh, no. What? All request guide. Why is my Persona 5 Strikers guide, like, still coming up? Children of Mana. Subquests. There we go. Was it side quests? When I enter side quests, it still pulls up the guide I was using for the subquests in, uh, Persona 5 Strikers. And that was, like, half a year ago. Over half a year ago at this point. Alright, so, uh, we can do... After Path of Light, after Chapter 7... The Rainbow Garden. Alright, I already I already procced that. I just haven't done it yet. So last time, uh... The Mana Lord. He is the amalgamation of all mana or something. Including dead spirits. Um... And, uh, he wants to flood the world with mana, which will kill everyone. Because it's apparently the will of the goddess. Um, and we're setting out to, to stop him. To stop all that, all that, all that jazz. Uh, he wants to, he wants to make the mana seed bloom in all the chaos. And it'll fill the world with mana. And it's, it's not going to be a fun time. We, none of us want that. We, we don't want that to happen. So we're on the quest to stop him. But, uh, right now I think I'm on a side quest. Which is, yep, comb the fiery sands of the flowers mentioned in the journal. Alright, this may be the last stream of this. I'm not sure yet. Depends on how long it takes. Knowing my luck, it probably isn't. Probably gonna have to do post-game tomorrow. But, uh, we'll, 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 First few notes of this song. It makes me think of the, um... Opening theme to uh, Osamatsu san. Now, what should I do? See the rainbow flowers. Let's visit the rainbow garden I read about in the journal. Alright. Back here again. Cool, fun. Super cool and fun. In a chest hidden by a cactus. Cool. That's that taken care of. Yeah, that uh, that Wheel of Fortune tweet is is making the rounds again. Uh, that's pretty cool. I it's so weird seeing certain people retweet it cuz like I have people I follow on all Twitter accounts, like not my main that are retweeting that tweet and I'm like, "Haha, I I I follow you from a different account." Oh nice. All right. Well, this easily. The fact that I spend so much time killing enemies is probably why this is taking a lot longer than it should. Uh these enemies are dropping Nothing. Okay, so I should probably just move on. All these enemies are only dropping like two health, uh, two experience each. It's not really worth it. It's funny because the other qu 
quests that I noticed today were only dropping two experience each was the one where I had to kill everyone. Dropping a few frames here, huh? It's not cool. So, uh, I was talking with people at work today, and I might- Oh god, I got reversed. Um, I might be taking some time off? Outside of what I already plan to take off this year. And, uh, I was thinking of maybe doing some sort of stream... Week, like streamathon hype week, maybe to finally step it up as a streamer and get some more more eyeballs on me. I'm gonna buy a chest and hit him in the cactus, okay? So I don't know. How I'm gonna go about that yet. If anyone, if anyone's run like successful stream marathons or anything before, uh, let me know. I'm looking for something with a little more, um, a little more pull to it than, uh, what I got for the charity streams. Because, I mean, I got a lot I got a lot of attention during that, but, man, you know I, I thrive on that shit. Um, but really, I just, you know, if I'm gonna take, like, a week off just to stream, I would really like it to pay off in some way. And, um, I think having some giveaways and stuff to drum up viewership might be a good idea. But, uh, I don't know. It kind of ties into the whole I feel I'm making no progress as a streamer type thing. Okay, can find a chest with the, uh... Two... Two... Two. Alright, yeah, it is not worth fighting these enemies. One second, I'm gonna try something here. Input, hold on, I want to see joystick mappings. Uh, left, right, up, down. Okay, way better. Oh, and the control pad still works too. I, I mapped it to the stick. And, Cause my thumb is, my thumb gets really tired playing this game for some reason, like I'm mashing the control pad really hard, but this has eight directional movement, so a joystick uh, is actually fine for it. Two, 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 two. Okay, yeah. No, we don't need to fight anything here either. Hidden by a plant. All right. Bam, 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 bam. Wham. Hey, sour cream. Yeah, bun butt. Urgh. No, f no, it's Fury, and no, I don't want to do that. This area is easy, because I'm not fighting anything. These enemies are only dropping two experience each. It's not worth fighting. Bam, 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 bam. 
I love the music here. It's so good. The music in this game in general is, is pretty choice. Two. Two. Okay, yeah, it's still not worth it. Hidden by plant, hidden by cactus. this quite I can't see hold on the, the screen is too big to see the uh, the hammer is really good what's this quest again this quest is find uh, the rainbow flowers which is to say just get to the end of the area just like every quest in this game Flowers, yep. We just got right left to find a rear flower, yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. Okay, I gotta stop that. So Switch got updated with the ability to uh, listen to Bluetooth, use Bluetooth headphones. That's cool. You would risk your life to find a floofy animal. Floofy animals are nice. See, the Switch can play Bluetooth headphones now, or use Bluetooth headphones, which is cool. you leveled up, yeah. Well, there's no point checking my menu. I don't think I got anything that's gonna help me here. Two experience. Two experience, okay. So the enemies are still on dropping two. Alright, so I gotta open a chest for a, a thing and break a cactus. What the scariest thing is? What? What is the scariest thing? Super tanky healer? Yeah. I'm sure when I eventually go back to Fuga, I'm gonna be fighting plenty of those. A certain group. Oh, I have to fight in this one. Shit. Alright. Oh, that's a new enemy. Yeah, that one's worth 20. If I should add a Spock command. Maybe. No, because I don't want to keep doing that. Also, if I go too loud, it's going to hurt my throat and it's going to annoy other people in this house. A squeak command? Uh, I don't know. That'll lose. The problem is, if I make any of those on demand 
it's gonna it's gonna make them lose their charm very quickly. Not everyone wants to hear squeaks constantly. I just realized your fury meter drains between areas. That's not cool. You use the rubber duck. It's not a rubber ducky. It's actually a squeaker. Squeak. said I had to. In my plant, in my cactus. All right, I'm right back to two, two experience each. You also like dealing heavy damage while having a heavy defense. Yep, that's pretty much what my character is. He's heavy damage, heavy defense. Not non-existent uh, magic power and very weak magic defense. Your tank uses magic, it'll be boosts and heals. Ah, good idea. Chest, and I need to unveil the exit. Alright, that doesn't work on flying enemies. Oh, 
Why am I stunned again? Okay. There's like shadowing effects in this game, which is interesting. That cactus. Knock it off. Might be able to level up here if there's enough of these uh, monkeys. Peace. Now we just need the exit. Yeah, I think I'm gonna stay here and level up though, because uh, now I'm actually very. I wasn't even trying to level up, and I'm almost at it. Oh, that thing doesn't even drop 20 anymore, now it drops 18. So this game has like a, a, a scaling EXP, where the more you higher level you are, the less enemies just drop. Winged bow. Bow. 
Yeah, I guess Persona... Does Persona use a scaling HP, uh, XP system? I know Pokemon went back and forth on whether or not it did and didn't. I think it does now, and it's not as good. There it is. I couldn't find a flower field anywhere. I knew that journal was a lie. Are these... seeds? Picked up plant seeds. I'm back. Welcome home. Did you find any flowers? No, not a single one. I knew it. I knew what? What did you mean by that? Have a look at this journal. I found it right after you left. Another one? Month of O, Day of X. I am back in the desert in Jad, where rainbow flowers once bloomed as far as the horizon. But now neither flowers nor weeds grow here anymore. All that remains is a sandy wasteland. The calamity that befell the world did not spare even one of those fine flowers. Only by the power of Mona, the Mana Goddess did the world escape complete annihilation. Damage caused by the disaster is so widespread that it will take the persistent and cooperative efforts of people everywhere for the world to be restored. I cannot say how soon, but I do know that one day flowers will bloom once again in this desert. That is my firm conviction. I'll return to my homeland to organize an investigative team. With recruits gathered from every land, we'll set our sights on Aluja Isle, where we can research the mighty Mana Tree. I am pleased that my old friend in Ish backs up my plan. With him on our side, gathering support from global leaders may not prove as difficult as I feared. What caused such a calamity? What caused such a calamity? And what do we really know of the Mana Goddess who saved us? The key to all our questions lies securely with the Mana Tree. Answers await us on Aluja Isle. If we seek, surely we will find. So the flowers of the desert were all burned ten years ago. Yes, it's a terrible pity. There was no one to escape from- there was no escape from such destruction. So it seems. The journal's pages are brimming with sadness from such a tremendous loss. By the way, the journal says, Calling volunteers from all nations to investigate Illusia where stands the Tree of Mana. Yes? I think the journal's author is... I would hate to be a healer since one enemy targets you first and two, you're a booster and a healer so your attack's like non-existent. Three, you're reliant on your allies. True. Wait, what? You were forced to fight the shadows of your family? Kidnapping tests, messing with people's minds. The Mono Lord doesn't have a conscience. Hello, Wanderer. How may I help you? Yeah, how may you help me? The Seed of Mana is the source of Mana power. If it's destroyed, the world will be annihilated by the Mana Surge. Wanderer, you must retrieve the Seed of Mana by any means necessary. Yeah, you need to rely on Mana if you're a mage. Don't I get anything for doing that quest? Rainbow Garden. Okay, blah blah blah. Weapon. Oh, cool. Oh, the the implication is that I have to go talk to the person who wrote it. Would rather be a DPS, an AOE, or a tank. 
I could switch to fit different needs, but I definitely like being, uh... I definitely enjoy the support roles, but I also don't know if I could commit to them. Hello, Wanderer. What can I do for you? Mayor Modi. Good day. What brings you here in such a rush? I heard you used to be quite an adventurer. What's this all of a sudden? And who told you that? I read your journal. It was in the archives. So the cat is out of the bag, I see. Say, Modi, I bet it was a pretty sight. Those desert flowers. Yes, they sparkled with all the hues of the rainbow. I just came back from Jad myself, but I saw nothing but sand. Well, they were destroyed ten years ago, you know. But look what I did find. Some seeds or something. Impossible. These seeds are of the desert flower. Really? Indeed. What a marvelous discovery, Wanderer. If they take root, why, the desert can be home to flowers once more. All right. That made the desert trip worthwhile. I'll look after the seeds for now. Let us have Professor Baum oversee their cultivation. Tell me when they bloom. Tell me when they bloom, all right? Of course I will. That's right. Such determination and curiosity should not go unrewarded. Please accept this. Rewarded with the Dwarven Mall. Thanks, Modi. No, it is I who should thank you. And before long, people of the world will show me their will show their gratitude as well. Ah, now you're overdoing it. Well, I'll see you later. Farewell, Wanderer. It's funny, we haven't seen Professor Bomb yet. Uh, all these are worse than what I have. Uh, this is better, but it's not until level 47. Winged Bow, 36. Silver Bow is level 40, that's what I have now. Dragon Bow is 58. Dwarven Maul, I can equip right now! Nice, perfect. It's a decent amount of, uh, hammer power, too. Hammer time. That's a timely meme. Oh god, that's from before they would be called memes. They're just references. Pop culture references. No such thing as memes back then. I think that's it in terms of quests. Friendship Beyond Words, I don't think I could do until the next, uh, the next dungeons are defeated. And again, all the po- all the mana quests, all the, uh, some, uh, spirit quests, just aren't procking, and I don't know why. This mechanic is annoying, it's like Digimon. Wait, which, uh, which mechanic? The quest mechanic? I have Cyber Sleuth, and I have never- I've never finished it, and I really wanted it, too. I gotta, uh, I gotta get back on that at some point. Boomer. What am I doing? Stop. I'm in the wrong place. Can't grab to be at a certain level to use the item, yeah. It really takes the progression out of the game, because it's like, okay, well, I have to level up regardless. Plus, all the armor that you could find, you could just buy. Like, 90% of it's in the shop. So it almost feels kind of pointless uh, to just have that level cap be involved. I'm also absolutely stacked with money right now because I have no need to buy anything. 
Like, the most I could see myself doing is fusing gems together to make some, like, super powerful shit. Best example of the Digimon game. Another famous, famous example is Pocky Ninja. Never played that one. Can you make my gem frame bigger? No. just a cheap trick to make a weak gem stronger. Um, apply to all party members, that doesn't help me. Prevents you from being stunned, that's pretty good. Shades favorite prevents you from being blinded. Prevents you from being confused, sleep, paralyzed, catching fire, turned into a snowman, disarmed. Poisoned. 10% bonus to Luger granted, really don't need that. Double drop ch doubles the chance that the item monsters will drop items in Luger. Eh. Increases experience gain by 50%. Two by two. That might be worth it, but then I have to remove a lot of shit. Oh, I have two steel hooks. Well, you know what? Let's make one. It's really not worth not doing it at this point. Look at that fine cut. Okay, what can I ditch here? Um, well, this is the problem. This thing is gonna have to get removed regardless. Soul of the Gemma. Is it Gemma or Gemma? I don't really want to take Lord of, Lord of Healers out, and Sword Expertise is pretty good. Yeah, it's really not worth it, unless I could expand the panel so I could get those top uh, corners. Yeah, it really isn't worth Like, I don't feel like it's worth it. I'm doing well enough on my own. If there was some sort of ultimate gem I could fuse, that'd be cool, but... Ain't happening. You got it. You caught the reference. Okay, uh, I don't think there's any more quests I could do now, because the rest... Pretty much most of the rest of them are from the spirits, and they're not giving them to me. Wait, what? Oh, here we go. Shit. Wait, perhaps... Okay, so he's talking about the Surge Mana. So wait, the Wisp one I could do? Oh, okay, so it is locked to the chapter that they're involved in. You just can't get them until later. Perhaps Light Gazer could tell you something. Light who? The Benevidon of Light. The Mana Surge turned him into a Malevidon, but you returned him to his true self. Benevidon of Light, eh? Well, maybe he could give me some helpful clues. Light Gazer the Luminous can be found in the ruins. Why don't you pay him a visit? Alright, I think I'll go see him. Tell him I said hello. Will do. Well, I'm off. Well, you're coming with me. You're my spirit. I have not removed Wisp from my party this entire game. Alright, so I could do this quest. I could do the this quest and the last quest in this chain. And then the other four I have to do um, after I beat the game. What should I do? Talk to the Benevidon of Light. Time for a chat with the Benevidon of Light. Wow, even these enemies would drop to two experience. Right now we are, uh, not able to level up that well. 
You want to pet his ears, but you fear he would drop kick you. Yeah, Wanderer is an intimidating person. Hidden by flowers in my. Oh my god, this is all plants. Kanji would like to want. Yeah, probably. Okay, that's revealed. Experience, two experience. Okay, yeah, I know. Again, if they're only dropping two, it's really not worth fighting two enemies. If any persona folks met water, I don't know. I'm sad you weren't here uh, when I was streaming Strikers. You probably would have uh, enjoyed that that stream. That was also my longest stream to date. That wasn't candy. Oh. Hidden by chest in my plant. Okay, well that was easy. Return of the burb, yep. Hey Ryoko, how you doing? Check something real quick, actually. Hold on. Let me refresh this. Alright, 
cool. I streamed Strikers? When? I, when it came, when it came out in America, I streamed, um... I streamed it, I streamed it up to the, I streamed up to the second dungeon. Um... Like, up till the middle of March, and then what happened was, um, I, I did, like, a charity stream, uh, thing with, with, a, with my Twitch stream. So I ended up taking a break from it for two weeks, and then I played it for, like, another month and a half. Oh, excuse me. Yes, I did finish it. Uh, it is, I think, 15 or 16 parts long, and then I did a, a quick video at the end of me fighting the Reaper. Just browsing your Twitch subs while message it, massaging this knot in your shoulder that you've had for months. Oh... I feel that. I'm, I might actually be getting, like, an actual massage soon, and I'm really... I'm looking forward to it. Played no games recently aside from Gaia Res? Never heard of it. Yeah. Alright, wait. I found the thing. I gotta find the exit. Did I like Sophie? Oh, right! I fucking... I'm sorry, I forgot there was a character in Persona 5 Strikers named Sophia. When I, I... I heard the name Sophie and I'm like, Sophie, wait, are you talking about... Uh, uh, never mind. Um... I thought you were talking about something else. Yeah, Sophie was a cool character. Her persona was really neat. Slash. Grab this. Slash. Slash. Oh my god, where is it? What? Okay, this is ridiculous. This is silly now. This layout sucks. This is it's like this on purpose. I mean, Strikers was months ago. I got that when it first came out. It reminds me of bad RNG and Roguelikes used to play. Also, Ga Gaia Res is a 1990s side scroller shooter. It looks really good. It's also really hard. Funny you say that. I actually just bought the um, Sega Ages version of um, Space Harrier the other day. Because I've always wanted to play it, and it's on sale for three bucks. So I was like, cool, I'll, I'll get it now. And um, I'm enjoying it. Definitely... It's weird. It's not super hard, but it is a fun arcade game. Uh, come on, are you serious right now? Space Harrier's quality, yes it is. Look at this. What is this? Why why is this set up like this? This is maximum grind. I guess they really anticipate you just doing this instead and, and whacking enemies into the stuff. Jack Iris, if you're looking for a new game in that vein. Uh, I'll definitely keep it in mind. It was also a Genesis game. Oh, nice. Cool. So I wasn't too far off the mark with the comparing it to Space Harrier. It's, it's another Sega. It's a whole Sega. What in Sega Genesis is going on here? This game be trolling. fight you.
Yeah, they just they give you the the key at the beginning, and now they make you f work to find the exit. God, really? I'm losing health just because this is solely taking way too long to go through. I think the biggest flaw in the game is the fact that the stuff that negates environment, like the customization stuff, you can only do it every four rooms, so it's like... If you see a room that's tailored a certain way and you're not equipped for it, then it's like there's no way of doing it. There it is. Am I gonna play Spirit Hunter Deathmark? You, I think you asked me about that before. I don't have plans to right now. Maybe at some point. But my streaming schedule right now is is absolutely stacked. Um, after I finish this, I'm going to be doing WarioWare. Uh, get it together for a couple days. Then I'm going to be doing a whole lot of Metroid for presumably the rest of this month and then the beginning of October. I'm gonna be finishing the Road to Dread streams I was doing. Hidden by flowers, hidden by a plant. Okay. So we're once again smacking plants around. And then once I finish Metroid, I'm gonna go back and start doing the other games I never finished. So Fuga's gonna get done. Neo World Ends With You is gonna get done. No More Heroes 3 is gonna get done. Probably gonna go back and finally finish Tribal Hunter. Maybe finally cap off low rank in Monster Hunter Rise. And then put that game away forever. Like I said, I wanna to try to do some sort of stream marathon soon, because I have four days, four or five days of, of time off that I haven't used that won't carry over to next year. So, at some point, I might just be taking, like, a week off work, and I would love to do some sort of, like, all-day streaming event, like, for most of that time, and make some sort of, like, do giveaways and stuff, and maybe try to, uh, try to, uh, like, raise, like, you know, make myself a better streamer than I am now, as in, have more eyes on me, I guess. Something like that, but... I also am afraid of doing it, because then I'm afraid of wasting my time on it. So, I don't know. Am I gonna co-op stream with Nessie? Nah, Nessie fell off, uh... Monster Hunter. I don't think she's too interested in doing that now. She's also very busy. The whole reason I don't stream on weekends is because I'm usually spending time with her. But, if, um... If I'm here, that usually means she's got stuff going on. Stream marathon, yeah. Oh, come on. I thought that was me for a second. I forgot the eyeballs can heal themselves. Yeah, if I did a stream marathon, it would probably be some stuff that I haven't streamed yet, or would probably be clearing out that backlog. Or something that I could, like, announce ahead of time. I don't know. The problem is, like, I don't know... Oh, cool. There. Well, there's that. Okay, now I just gotta find the, uh... Exit key. I don't say she's Eldritch, I just say she's a sea monster. God, having my direction reversed is very annoying.
All right, you want the squeaker? I'll give you the squeaker. Hold on. I find it funny how right now I'm doing I'm I'm pulling out a squeak toy for someone uh She is cute. Yes, thank you. Um, I'm pulling out the squeak toy for like two people on the internet. While, me while meanwhile, a meme tweet I made two months ago is getting like thousands of retweets right now because some big YouTubers uh, just retweeted it like a few hours ago. Life is weird like that. Oh, nice. I'm out of here. Or am I? Hold on. It's gonna be the bait. Yeah, it is. <laughs> I keep forgetting that that statu those statues uh, reflect you. They do not like the sacrilege going on in front of you. Bond of Demons. Wow, this was not worth coming over here for. This area in general is annoying. <laughs> I was so happy with the boss here, and then it's like the boss fight ended up being annoying too. Like, ah, uh, upsetting. Absolutely need to save. Hidden by the flowers, hidden by a plant. Oh god, again? This map sucks. I'm really, I'm really not happy with it. I keep switching back to the control pad, even though I've mapped this to my, uh, my joystick. Okay, there's the exit. Cool. Oh, that's weird. Look at the map. It's actually like a weird crisscross pattern. Hidden by a plant. All right, so I have to find the small plants to destroy. Nice. We're out of here. What platform this game is on was on without looking it up. I mean, it's not too hard. Look at look at uh, how my streams laid out. There's not many choices. Hate the reverse thing. Defeat a certain group hidden by. Oh god! So this is a fight enemies thing anyway.
Hidden by a pl- okay. Yep, it's original DS. This is an early DS game, actually. This came out in 2006. Um, only like a year and a half after the actual DS did. Came out around the same time as New Super Mario Brothers, I believe. Okay, how come that time I selected it and it didn't close the menu? Ah, that's disappointing. Geometry Wars Galaxy, Geometry Wars, uh, Dimensions Evolved. I, I've seen Geometry Wars. That looks fun. Not a game I, not a game I'm sure I'd spend a lot of time on. Yeah, it is trippy. Oh, cool, there's the exit. Alright, so now I just need to find the key. Hey, Stone. Yeah, no problem. I pretty much follow everyone back at the moment. I don't have the, uh... Oh, nice, I needed that. Feed a certain group hidden by a plant. Okay. Well, this is the same map I was in just before. That's really annoying. Oh, can't hold the Angel Grail. I replaced the last bot that you had stuck on your followed you list. Yeah, I hate that blocking them doesn't just remove them from the list. It's very annoying. Also, I've noticed I haven't gotten a bot following me in a few days now, so I'm wondering if uh, maybe Twitch has finally uh, gotten rid of them. Especially now that they, they know who's responsible for it. God, I hate that. Does get removed? Yeah, if it gets banned. But if you ban them, uh, nothing happens. It's annoying. Okay. Cool. I'm low on health because I keep getting reversed. This map sucks. I'm not. I'm not happy with it. Okay, there. Can it, I can leave now. They found. They've narrowed it down to two people. Apparently, I don't know much about it. I haven't really been keeping up with it. This really should have just been taken. Like this shouldn't have happened in the first place. That's kind of the main issue. Might as well just use these. I'm not in any. Cons uh, I'm not making any sort of conservation efforts here with the items, since I'm loaded on money anyway. After nine painful levels, okay, so I got three more to go here. Hidden by flowers, hidden by a plant. All right, so let's just start smashing. Anyway, I started smashing.
So yeah, I saw that the person of the real, the real person, but um, those bots were impersonating is like very upset about it. Obviously, I would be too, but that's like disgusting because apparently they were like a victim of this whole thing, and then they just like used him as a scapegoat. And it sucks. My ear is itching. Hold on. Thanks, Sean. You didn't have to do that. Thank you. What the heck? How come... Oh, there's a chest over there. Alright. Again, always appreciate subs. They are not necessary. I make plenty of money with, with, with my current life, even if I'm not... Even if it's not ideal. I would like Twitch to be, like, if Twitch was a revenue stream for me, like a valid one, then I would totally love that, but I don't think it's going to happen. Right now, pretty much any money I make from Twitch, I just donate to charity. good I'm, I'm i i support some people too um who twitch though I've, i stopped the last month just because i wanted everything to sync up and then twitch got into this whole mess so it's like uh, i just stopped for a little while probably um on october 1st i'm gonna resume uh supporting people just because then it l uh, links up with the patreon pledge because patreon now does this thing where they charge you first of the month no matter what so, uh, I'm thinking I'm gonna sync all my subs up to that day so that everything just gets charged at once. Flowers in my plant. Oh god, this. Why is it always these huge ones? Ah. This game's annoying. Like, it has a lot of good concepts, but the game itself is just kind of annoying. These trap things are really annoying, these plants. It's because, like, if you're even a slightly too close to those plants when they break open, they, they get you with their shit. Gnome's favor. Alright, well, I 
I got that. I just have to find the exit. Time, so I don't look yet. Alright, I think there's only one or two more rooms left. Sorry, I just gotta get get out of here. And there we go. They said nine areas, and now I'm in a tenth area. But thankfully, it's a uh, it's an event battle, so that was easy. You made these boxes, there's a punch in the- yeah, they do. You must be Light Gazer. Yes, I remember you. What do you want? I want you to tell me more about what's happening to our world. Very well, what knowledge do you seek? Gems. What are gems? I know not. They are new to us. Perhaps the Surge has brought them forth. Oh. But gems are more than just containers in which the powers of mana reside. What? I can feel a powerful will, like the wishes of mankind. Perhaps through the rending of space and time, they have some connection with the lost that have returned. Thanks, I learned a lot. Let not the burden of fate weigh you down. Farewell, brave Niccolo. Oh wait, I only get to ask one question? Picked up Lustrolex. Bye, Light Gazer. So I did that. This shade gives me a thing after the next chapter. Uh, but... Yeah, like the other ones that give me the quests, they just don't do it. But apparently I could go back and do them later. Because doing all of them is what uh, unlocks... Um, is what unlocks the final mission. The final post-game mission. Alright, with all that being said, I think it's time to finally move on to the next chapter. There's two chapters left. Yeah, I think it's safe to say this probably isn't going to be the last stream of this, just because between the last area... Because after I do this next area, there's going to be three more quests, and then... You have a theory on the... Gems, it's okay. I'll mix them out. Yeah. 
I enjoyed that show. I miss it. Dragon Bow. They're living people, though. I think that was the whole point. Brigand's cloak, dragon armor, can't equip that. Um, can't equip this, but I don't need it. Two stuff here. Oh, Forty three. Eh, it's really not worth buying stuff. Like, it really isn't. You find better stuff out in the field. That dude in the blue shirt looks like, uh, Vent from Mega Man ZX. Which is a game I very much enjoyed str N Wait a minute, what am I saying? That game pissed me off when I streamed it. Wait a minute, actually, let's return to Mana Village real quick. I forgot to check certain items here. Mysterious stone imbued with the power of light by the light gazer. Mysterious stone, okay. The benevolent of light is believed to be its source. Okay, so what do I do with it? Writings, and writings by an adventure regarding a trip to Jad, regarding a trip to Ch Topple, regarding the Great Cataclysm. What happened if you gave a robot empathy and emotion, they become people just like Sophie? Yep, yeah, exactly. I'm Michael, humanity's companion. Uh, path of life. There we go. Let's do it. So the mana lord is down below. Wait, wanderer. Tess? This may be the last battle. I'm sure he knows it, too. Probably. I... What's wrong, Tess? Everyone has been fighting for their lives, but I... I can't do a thing. I feel so useless. You've got it all wrong. What about all the times you've helped me out? I would never have made it this far without you. Believe me, you're far from useless. Thank you, Wanderer. Well, on to the center of all the chaos. If I could figure out how to get there, that is. Wanderer, that glow... It's the harmonica from the Sanctuary of Mana. Why was it glowing like that? Oh. Maybe it leads underground. Only one way to find out. Please come back safely, Wanderer. I will. Path of Life.
Holy shit. All right. All right, cool. Oh, okay, guys, got it, got it. You're, you're strong, I got it. Really? That thing just chases you until it hits you, huh? So once it fires, you're, you got nothing once you guard it. I love getting punished for, for miss swinging, like slightly. Ah, that's neat. Pound those down, the other ones come up. Oh, if you want to look up, um, if you want to look up fan art of this character, look up Niccolo, N-I-C-C-O-L-O. -O. There's two versions. There's the bunny version and the cat version from, uh, the earlier games. Really? I guarded and it still hit me? a certain monster hidden by a certain plant. Oh god, the bad plants here straight up stun you. That's not good. This sucks. This area, like, it, I thought the last area couldn't get any bit worse, but this area is a kind of uh, competing. Just the amount of times I have to stop attacking is very annoying. Like, if you're gonna throw this many enemies at me, don't throw status ailments that make me run away, please. And don't do this. What is this? What is this? Where the, the enemies spawn on top of me until I until I do something? That's so annoying. What is the point? Like, I haven't even explored this area yet because I'm too busy fighting these enemies. Stop! Oh my god.
Really? Alright, well, I guess that was the whole point of that room. That's annoying, though. I don't like that. And then a chest in the plant. Cool. Okay, those things just explode and do a shitload of damage. My Borb is adorable. Yes, he is. He's adorable. Silver hammer. Music's pretty good. Nice. Shams here I lost before. Shimmering ring. A certain monster and the area is open already. Oh, okay.
Oh. One chest, somehow. Level 43, oh nice! Cool. Hit those swords 47. Dragon Bow is much later. Silver Hammer is not as good. 44, so I can't put that on now. I can't put the Shimmering Ring on, which doesn't do anything because I don't use magic attacks. I know what you're trying to say, <laughs> you said... Typed in ba you were supposed to you were trying to type in Baba Booey, <laughs> but it says Baba Boy. <laughs> I, find, I find that actually funnier. Floomph? Yeah, Floomph's a good word. Love Floomph. Love the Mets, baby. I just retweeted it. Oh fuck no! This is the wrong weapon. Get this shit off here. Oh, that did nothing. Ass. Ass, don't explode! Oh, those are the faces from, uh, Trials of Mana. Like the ones in the, um... Oh, these just cause random ailments every time they hit you. Right, there's the exit. Status Element City. Damn, they suck, yeah. Yeah. 
Feed a certain group hidden by a certain plant. Okay. The area effect monsters suck. Targeting there. Okay, cool. Like the targeting. Painful. I guess that's the exit. Nope, that isn't. Hell, like, again, why do they have to spawn so many enemies per floor here? The game is challenging enough with how it already s is set up, so... the exit piece. I 
after I've literally killed almost every other monster on the field here. Correction, every monster on the field. Chest implant. So I need a chest to open a chest to get the key, and we need the big uh, plants for the uh, exit. Oh, cool. I actually got affected by that, and I had a disarmed effect. Yeah! Yeah! This is fun. I love how this does make the spikes go down, but I keep running over them before they hit the ground. So it doesn't count. I don't like these, like they don't work right. Oh cool. Didn't my hammer out. Alright, there's the exit. Now I just need to find the actual uh I still don't know how to get like past that. Whatever, it doesn't matter. I got it. Let's take a nap real quick. Okay. A certain group. Oh, cool. This is an event uh, room. Perfect.
And again, I missed five chests somehow. I, I did level up, so 44. Uh, none of these are better. I can't equip any of them. Brigand's cloak, I can't cloak on equip, though. There you go. Better defense. Oh, okay. Chug there for some reason. Better do like an important save, like the big save. Alright, keep it going. Hit him by a plant to feed a certain group. Okay, I see the cracks on the floor, so I know I'm gonna get juggled around as soon as I step on shit in here. Yep. No, they just stun you in place. With any luck, this will be the last segment of this uh, dungeon, and the last dungeon will be four segments, probably. Rabbit Mon. Yep, there goes the bouncies. Oh, cool. Yeah, I'm glad I could just get juggled by that. Exit. Stop respawning every two seconds. white robe. Stop spawning in such great numbers. It really sucks. It, like, it's like defeat a certain enemy, and it's like, yeah, that enemy spawns after you've killed like 20,000 of the other enemies here. Really dumb. Makes these levels take way longer than they should, in my opinion. Up. 
Oh, this is an eliminate all monster stage. almost over now, right? Have you ever played Parappa the Rapper? Yes, I have. Uh, I have it on PSP, and it is not fun on PSP. I don't know if it's just the PSP version, or if the game itself is like this, but the hitting the beats does not match up to, uh, to what's on screen. And I never got the hang of freestyling. Do you know why we forgot? Do you know why we stopped the car? It's because I forgot to close the door. Oh, look at this bullshit setup. Here's what we'll do. Bonk. 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 There we go. Really? Hidden in a chest, hidden by a plant. Okay. Yes, enemies can attack other enemies, but they're mostly getting caught in the traps, I think. than I hoped.
<gasps> Exploded, fucking Christ, alright. Yeah, like, I don't know how to deal with these traps. I can never figure out how to disarm them. I've tried doing that, I've tried swiping, and it just does one damage. Maybe damage more in free mode? I tried that before. There's the exit. Did my room just flicker? Uh, hold on. Okay. Absolutely don't want to get caught. Why is this area so big? It's really just there to like pull a gotcha on it, on you to so you get to the end and then it's like yeah there was nothing rewarding up here this game kind of suffers from that same like secret of mana syndrome where it's like lots of pathways that just go nowhere and you might get a reward for it but it's usually just an empty room with more enemies or like an item you don't need secret of mana was very bad with that Yeah, I saw the lights in my room flicker uh, for a second. I was like, uh-oh. So I did a save state because I don't want to uh, lose my progress here. Okay, cool. Defeat a certain group. Oh, it's one of these rooms again. Imagine getting hit while you were leaving. Yeah, I mean, it's happened. Seven. Looks like it says sham shit on the top screen. What's a sham shear? Looks like it says sham shit. 
58, 41, not as good. 60. But, yeah, I'm not getting to that point right now. Soul Ring, 48. Mythical Ring, 52. Yeah, no. Welcome to the path of life, the heart of the chaos. I've been expecting you. The time has come. Soon this planet will drown helplessly in a sea of mana. It will be envelop enveloped... Excuse me. In the dazzling radiance of life in its purest form. All shall return forever to mana. <laughs> What's the purpose of all this? Purpose? There is no such thing in this world. It's merely an artificial measure that your kind imposes at whim. Why don't you explain the purpose of that to me? What could be more meaningless? It's nothing more than an illusion. Well, shall we end this once and for all? I'm glad you're here. The show would have been a waste without an audience. Watch as I crack the seed of mana open right before your eyes. Don't! Mana, swallow it all. Swallow it all? Swallow it all. Huh? <sighs> no, the Fruity Pebbles. They're containing it. W what is this? How could Geodes have such power? This, uh, this is impossible for mere crystals of mana. Could it be? Could these Geodes be crystals of living memory? Each one a will to live, crystallized and preserved by the power of mana. So you have come here from the future ruins of the Sanctuary. Ludicrous! You think you could stop me with this nonsense? Get out of my sight! No. Immune to the Sword of Mana? This cannot be happening! Look at this cutscene, I'm getting border. The Sword of Mana is... not a mere weapon. Don't you hear the voices of the gems? Life must go on, and that is where one finds true meaning. Yeah, the protag just stands there and does nothing while this all happens. Silence! Silence! shall send you to oblivion along with these meddlesome geodes. Now your time has come! Time to fight the rabbit man. That didn't even hurt me. Please tell me that wasn't it. It appears you have some fight in you, but do you really think a worm like you can defeat me? This is it. Prepare to meet your fate! Giant monster form? Nope, just more of this. Jesus, why is the, why are the bosses so easy? That was ridiculous how easy that was. Silver rank. We didn't even get to hear that cool music. Diamond armor, uh, holy robe can equip, elemental ring, 54. I guess we could take the diamond armor. My fate was worth 1,500 points, yes. The moment when the first- Yeah, the first boss was difficult. Every other boss since has been a piece of- No, the second boss was difficult. Second boss killed me three times. 
Every other boss was a piece of cake. Even the the amalgamate from last night, it was just took forever to fight it. Ugh. The goddess has just descended into this world and does not yet understand herself. And so her powers, unchecked, spun out of control. This produced an entity with a will of its own. Which is now running amok, deliriously intoxicated with its own powers. It is roaming the entire planet, laughing like an innocent newborn baby. Yes, the force behind the Great Surge of Mana is a child. The Scion of Mana. That'll be the next game, after Sanctuary of Mana. The Scion of Mana? Give the Seed of Mana to the Maiden. She should know its true use. And you could take this sword. When the first columns of light sprouted on Illusia, it was the goddess who sent you this sword at the tower. Yes, I know. I had a feeling. She must have wanted you to stop the chaos she could not. But that was all she could do. By then, the mana tree itself was dormant, shackled by the uncontrollable power of the mana columns. You mean, you knew that mana the mana goddess was trying to stop the chaos? What a laugh. After giving birth to the scion and I, she was struggling with all her might to stop us. If you knew all that, why did you... Because that's what I am. What? I was born to fill the world with mana. I was merely carrying out my duty. A duty which I have yet to complete. But now I see. The gems are a f fusion of the force of mana and the will to live of the creatures on this planet. Yeah, we just bitch slap them to bring them back to his senses. How far will you and the gems get fighting mana? How I long to free mana's powers. The powers of the Scion! I am the Mana Lord! Dear planet, witness my end! Take my life, my child! Wait, don't do it! Yeah, nah, ain't happening, buddy. No! This is bad. Nothing can stop Mana's powers now. Obtain the Holy Sword, obtain the Seed of Mana. Dip. Pumpkin boy. It's a whole lot of cutscenes, all right. A rift that has opened in the skies above the mana tree. It seems the source of the chaos, the scion of mana, is there. Aye. Looks like we've got no choice but now to charge in and stop this madness ourselves. You mean... Face off directly against Mana's powers. Is such a thing even possible? We can do it. We got the Holy Sword on our side. Right, Wanderer? Well, maybe not. What's this? The sword is covered in black vines. Is this really the Holy Sword? Perhaps this is a sign that we were wrong to expect the sword to bear its fangs against Mana itself. You saying the sword has forsaken us? Well, let it. I cannot hate. The real fight begins when all hope is lost and you've got and you've fallen as far as you can fall. If you don't do something, the world's going to wither away. The time for arguing has passed. This is the time to fight. The fight against Mana. The accent just changed in the middle of that. Watts, 
We'll be all right, Modi. The Mana Goddess won't forsake us. We won't lose. With the sword in such bad shape. The Holy Sword is more than a mere weapon, Modi. It's blessed with the power to see things right. Set things right, as it did when it turned the Malevadons back into Benevadons. Benevadons. As long as we are fighting to set the world right again, the sword will lend us its power. I'm sure of it. Yes, Tess is right. I'm off! And the Mana Goddess is kind of like an unknown entity. Enter the Cosmic Rift and stop the chaos to restore everything to normal. The Holy Sword will give you strength. Fight with all your might! Believe in the power of the gems and fight till the end. The Bomb Brothers are behind you 100%. Millionaire, do you have a moment? Why, it's Wanderer. What can I do for you? Have you ever seen this before? Why, it's a harmonica. The shadows of Sophie and Danny dropped it at the ruins. Sophie? Oh, yes, that widow who took you in. That's right. I gave my harmonica to Danny as a present. A present? One day, 12 years ago, I was playing that harmonica when a boy suddenly approached me. He asked me what instruction it was. What sorry, what instrument it was. And that's how I met him and his widowed mother. I see. I never stayed in one place for long, but they treated me like family. I only planned to stay for a few days, but one week became three, and the months stretched on. Before long, I felt like I wanted to stay with them forever. Yes, I remember. Brightwood, ten zones. Oh, God. Yes, I remember. You sent me a letter asking for help in starting your own shop. I was unwavering in my dedication, so I worked like I'd never worked before, so I'd have a business of my own. But I couldn't amass enough cash, so I asked you for help. When I saw your letter, I couldn't believe it. I never thought you'd want to settle down anywhere. I could hardly believe it either. All the other Nicolos always made fun of me, but I knew that I was one too. So that's how it happened. But I lost it all. Shop and family. Ten years ago, right? Yes, they didn't survive the destruction. And the house burned to ashes. I see. He was only seven. Too young to die. Terrible. It all came back at the ruins when I heard their voices and the sound of my old harmonica. It's something I wish I could forget. Are you sure that's what you want? Hmm? Those are precious memories, aren't they? Well, yes, but it hurts to remember. It's not all painful, is it? Well... Whether good or bad, they're all precious memories of your family, right? I... Don't forget them. No, you should hold them close. Those memories are lifelong treasures. I... I know. Hmm? What's the matter? We're waiting in Wendell. What? I think I just heard Sophie and Danny call to me. They said they're waiting for me in Wendell. You heard them? Then you should head to Wendell and see. It's not healthy to suppress your feelings, you know. You're right, I'm going to Wendell. Better sooner than later, Wanderer. You're right. Neat. Alright, so we got one quest here. This is the... Each character has their own sp a unique quest to them, so this is Wanderer's quest. Something happen? Oh, okay.
really don't need any money. Like, it, I'm so loaded on money. It, it, for, it's so weird. Like, at the beginning of the game, it's so sparse. Sparse, scarce. And now at the end, it's like you're drowning in it. <laughs> Wanderer, use double slash. Alright, before I do this next mission, I'm gonna take a quick bathroom break because uh, I have to go. <laughs> so let me, uh. Nice. Thank you for pushing me, NPC. Let me go to the bathroom real quick, and I will be right back. Thank you. And I return. Uh, I was gone for what, two minutes? Did the world collapse while I was gone? Ah, emails that don't retain, pertain to me at all. Cool. Sorry about that. Neat. Alright, we're ready to get going here. To Wendell. Cosmic Rift, which we're not going to. Oh look, all the spirits are there. So what's on the bottom left? There's nothing on that island at all? Confused. Is there no other areas in this game? Yeah, I don't think there is. I think that area is just blank. You just never go to it. It's really weird. Anyway, rent bundle to the Brightwood. Now, what should I do? See the two of them one more time. Time to go see the two of them one more time. 
If it's a DLC, this is a DS game. There's no DLC in DS games. I put four experience each. It's not too bad, but I don't see myself getting by a stump. By slashing? That was weird. Mole near. Wow. Hanging out here, huh? Hidden by a mushroom, okay. I'm out of words for this game. I mean, it's it's nice, I guess. When it isn't frustrating, it's good. Okay, they're only dropping two, so I'm not gonna bother. You got a weapon of God while I just have this bomb from a boss. <laughs> yeah, 
Molnir just fucking hanging out here. That's cool. Beat a certain group hidden by a stump, great. So it's kill all enemies, essentially. Okay, I need you guys to stop digging underground. You're causing way too much lag. We can uh, do without that, thank you. Damn shit. Nice. God, whiffing with the hammer sucks. That's like the most punishing thing in this game. There's the exit. Now where did, where's the uh, key? so big. <laughs> the bomb enemies be thick. Well, they're pumpkins. Pumpkins are indeed thick.
really? Somehow I got disarmed? That's cool. Oh, here we go. Now, there, now there's enemies down here. I For a game where you can't save every floor, they sure do make some of these floors long as fuck. there are this is annoying and, and you know this isn't the last area of the, air, the the last room of the area there's gonna be another whole like two probably segments this dungeon left That's why the game takes longer a lot longer than you think to beat it I thought it was very short but now it's this is definitely gonna be at least another whole stream if not more spawn up there. Jesus, it took forever. I level up 46. Ivory Hammer. That's actually worse than what I have. Dwarven Maul is better. However, Molnir is even better than that, but I can't equip that till 63, so that ain't happening. 49. Nope, not happening. Alright, let's continue. Bigger than your attention span. <laughs> that doesn't really speak. I don't really think that speaks volumes here. Exactly. Oh, the key's all the way down there, isn't it?
Sour Cream, you shouldn't put yourself down like that. I'm sure, uh... You'll... That, that aspect of your life will work out soon. Ish. Just gotta keep yourself open. Yep, there's the fucking key. Unbelievable. No, don't explode, you asshole. How are you still alive, by the way? Get that out of here. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Oh, there's more- Really? Spawned in a shitload of enemies on the way out? I don't care. I don't care, you guys give two experience, I don't want to fight you. Hidden in a chest, hidden by a stump. Okay. Not good. That experience is gone. There's the exit. Look at the Once again, huge fucking areas for no reason. A double healing thing is definitely necessary for the later parts of this game. <laughs> you tell me that one touch any walls for in case for secrets. Bigger rooms means boss battles, and if an enemy looks cute as fuck, you should stay away unless you're strong on EXP. Yes. Exactly. Reminds me of when I fought the Carbuncle in Final Fantasy VII Remake. I was like, oh my god, it's a Carbuncle. I know this thing's gonna kick my ass, but I'm gonna fight it anyway. Wait, what? Huh? Kill enemies and get all loots, yes. Okay, this sucks. I went all the way over here for nothing. This game really knows how to waste your time. It does not respect your time. So you're telling me that all the shit I was looking for is all just all down here. I didn't have to do any of those other parts at all. That's what the game is telling me right now. That's what I'm expecting to figure out here. Yep, the exit was right there the whole time. This was all pointless. Every doing everything in this room was pointless. <laughs> Defeat a certain group, okay. Well.
You know any rooms that feels like it would be a boss battle? I mean, in this game, every room. Because every room is way harder than a boss battle. Just in the sheer enemy spam that this game throws at you. I mean, you've seen how easy the boss battles are in this game. Seeds are full heals, that's really good. Hey Kira Demon Child, how you doing? Wham! Alright, let's go, let's go! Gold armor, nice. My HP was nice. Oh, did it end in 69? Or did I have 60, 69? Oh yeah, no, my, my max HP. I'm good, how are you doing? Oh, I guess you just said you were good. <laughs> I'm good, just unwinding after a day of work. Sour cream is suffering as usual. Oh look, it's this room again. It's this exact same room I was just in. Gleam drops in a small mushroom, cool. the exit. So I just gotta find the mushroom that has the, the key in it. The soundtrack slaps? Yes, it does. Despite my wavering opinions on the Mana series... I, wow, that was a nice voice crack. Uh, despite my wavering opinions on the Mana series, I cannot deny that the uh, soundtrack does indeed slap. Yep, let's get all my HP back real quick. No, I think that was that was the first real voice crack. If you listen to my old streams from like 2017, uh, you could tell that my voice cracked a ton back then.
which is funny because I, you know, I'm not young. So even back in 2017, I wasn't, I wasn't that much different than I am now. Got your first COVID jab tonight. Nice. Yeah, I was going through existential puberty. No, I need... Ah, oh, Why didn't I grab that? Why did I leave it sitting there? Egg! Even though it's not really an egg. Alright, area clear. <laughs> Burb noises? Well, I can almost equip the, sh the uh, next level here. Wait, wait, holy flail. 44. Why is my flail... Why are my flail... Like, flails always, like, way lower level than where I actually am. I need to up to bu just buy the higher leveled one so I can prepare for it and equip this now. 58. Molnir 63, damn. Molnir got hands. Uh I'm not doing a I'm not doing a loud screwy sound. I'm sorry. It is way too late at night for that. In fact, I probably should be stopping soon. After I finish this quest, I'll probably get the trigger for the next quest and then stop. Because there's another two side quests before I can finish the last dungeon. Soft screen, okay. Screen! ASMR screen. Chest in my stomach. <laughs> that was adorable. <laughs> Celebrate that level up by falling asleep. Uh, hello? Okay. That wasn't cool. Thirst, that's new. Holy shit, what is going on here? All right, I just need to get, uh, you know, I just need to get through, please. What the fuck is this? What the hell is this shit? And these guys still are only dropping two experience each, so it's not worth fighting them. Lore of Angels. Yeah, it's because my mind is so low that, uh, I'm just getting my ass kicked whenever magic is involved. Again? Okay. Scree. Scree. 
the stump, right? Yep. What a shock. Tide of shoot overload. <laughs> in a chest, okay. Wow, two, two XP, nice. I'm thinking tonight, tomorrow night, I don't know how long the finale of this game's gonna be, because I thought it was gonna be tonight, it's not. I think we might, I mean, we might have a whole stream ahead of us still. this. Please don't eat me. Okay. I'm not that cute. <laughs> Alright, maybe I am. I don't know. Piss. Fucking Christ. Alright. Wow. Wow. That sucked so much ass. Hidden by a mushroom hit. Oh, it's different now, too. Great. Wanderer's not sneaky. He's kind of just the get in and smash it kind of guy. Okay, there's the exit. Now I have to figure out where the key is. Actually, you know what? I know probably exactly where the key is because there's only one place it could be. It could be. It's gonna be at the very end of that long fucking hallway that I don't want to go down. Oh wait, never mind. It's completely different. God oh, damn it! All right. There it is. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Hidden by a mushroom. Nintendo Direct ain't happening. 
that was so rumored. Instead, we got a Switch update this week, which I mentioned before. Let you use Bluetooth headphones on the Switch, which is cool, I guess, but... Not really my thing. Yes, that is me. I am Burb. Oh, look, it's this pathway again. So psyched. For what? The, uh... Sm last Smash character? Or the Bluetooth headphones? I mean, I tried them, they do work, and mine, thankfully, don't lag too much, so, like, if I wanted to play Tycho, I can. But I also... I only have one pair of Bluetooth headphones, and... You've gotta be fucking kidding me. And having to constantly repair them with the phone and my Switch... ...is just a pain in the ass, so I prefer just using the wired headphones. Plus, using the Bluetooth headphones on the Switch creates, um... ...certain complications, like, I can't use local wireless. I mean, it is cool. It's very interesting that it took Nintendo this long to implement it, but whatever. Nice HP. I missed it. Was it 69 again? It's not an egg, it's a drop. It's a drop of mana. Please let this be the end. Yes, it is. Yeah, if I'm out of HP, I'm dead. Sophie, Danny, it's me, it's Wanderer. Come, show yourselves again. <laughs> Listen closely, I cannot see you anymore. But I want you to have this. I'm watching over you from above. Do your best to make the future a bright one. Farewell, Wanderer, my love. Undertale vibes. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Obtained light on a nomad. This gem is a crystal of their hearts. Thank you, Sophie. Danny. Wanderer's story comes to a close. Did the very little story he gets. Let's see what that uh, gem does. This does something good because I want it to. Light on a nomad. Hammer attack plus 20. Defense plus 10 and mine plus 10. Size 1 by 1. Holy shit. That's actually really good. Considering it gives me mind, I could probably just ditch one of these. Hell yeah. Kill the cuber. Stop. Just jam that thing in my uh, in my gem frame, buddy. Almost out of it. Stop. <laughs> the 
final battle at last. Your duty is clear. Quell the mana, Surge, and restore peace to the world. Alright, time to empty my uh, inventory yet again. Did I miss the cutscene? Yeah, you did. Were you not paying attention? Equip the mithril sword now? I think I can. Oh, the Wi Fi fucked you. Perfect time to die. Actually, wait a minute. People's names are different colors now. Did I get disconnected? Oh, that's gonna piss me off. I'm not happy about that. Bye. We're gonna buy uh, as many items as we need here. Oh, you changed your name color. Okay. Alright, in the meantime... Flails. I need better flails. Dragon flails, 57. 53. 48. Silver flail. Okay, so I'm gonna buy the mithril flail just because... I keep falling behind in terms of the flail that I need. Iron... Okay, bows. I'm just gonna buy bows here. 49 is the next one. It's mithril. Oh, I cannot equip it, though. Oh, you know, because it's just the next level up. I'm an idiot. Warhammer, Ivory, okay. Mithril is level 50. Ring is 57. Okay. There, now I have everything I can equip at the next possible level up. 52. 48. 49. And then the rest of the... And then 50. And the rest of these are all higher leveled. So I could sell these two. I don't need these two anymore. Wow, look at that. Look at that lucre. 99,999 on the dot. Incredible. It's only game. 
Golumph, you come in. Say, you're short one Dudbear, aren't you? Dudbear Golormar. Get info. Oh, that's why. Hagarumph, Chikalumph, Mangarumph. Hmm? No word three days, Brumph. Galabalumph, Mandabumph. Oh, maybe that Balumph. What's going on? What did he say? Lorimar Dudbear, clumsy, oomph. Maybe made accident, grumph. Accident? Worry now. But must dud stay dud services. Shagarumph, wanderer go. Huh? You go Lorimar, oomph. Find clumsy Dunbear. You get, we pay, Maralumph. Not a problem. I'd be glad to help. Thanks, Arumph, wanderer. Somewhere, so missing, so the missing Dudbear is somewhere in Lorimar, right? Right, oomph. Dudbear go, Ice Citadel, get info. Got it. Well, I'm off. Okay, so we got our next quest. Find the missing Dudbear who was headed for the Ice Citadel. Friendship beyond words. I believe this is the last normal quest of the game for me, actually. Once this is done... Uh... Where's subquest guide? I need to pull it up again. Yep, Friendship Beyond Wars is the last one, and this takes ten levels to do. So we're not getting through this anytime soon. But I've done every other main quest, and then after that's just the rest of the Benevidon quests. Most of which I can't do until uh, I beat the game now. So, wow, my Twitter is still blowing up. People are just loving that, uh, fucking, uh, stupid tweet I made. Follow me. If you're gonna be retweeting my stuff, give me a follow, damn it. Alright, whatever. Uh, so yeah, next time on, uh, well, how long have I been streaming? Hold on, I just want to check. Okay, it's been over three hours. So... Tomorrow, uh, tomorrow I might start, well, I say I'll start early and then I won't, so that'll happen. So tomorrow, uh, we will finish off the two quests right now, go to the last dungeon, finish it off, and then do as many of the elemental Benevidon quests afterwards we can do, and then that'll unlock one final side quest and the game's over. So I think I have one more full stream of this. I might try to start early tomorrow just so I can have time to do everything and get this done. And then I might take uh, Thursday off. Uh, we'll see. But yeah. More of this. More of a... Uh... <laughs> you following me? Thank you. I was talking about Twitter. Okay, so right now on Twitter, I I made this tweet a few months ago about the Ubisoft uh, Wheel of Fortune game on the Switch. And it started blowing up on Twitter. Like, it's it, a bunch of, like high follower people on Twitter started following it, or started liking it, and now it's just going out of control. It's quite funny, actually. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> Benevidon. Do, 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 do. Benevidon. Do, 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 do. Uh, but, yeah. More of this tomorrow, hopefully the end of it. Uh, if it is, then Thursday will probably be a day off. This weekend... Uh, WarioWare Get It Together. Um, I might do something else. I might do some, uh... I was thinking of maybe doing some Spelunky on stream. I have not been playing that game on stream, but I might consider it. And, uh, after all that, uh, the Metroid Metroid Metroidvania, the Metroid Road to Dread will continue. I'll be doing the last two games before Dread comes out, and if I planned it, if I time it right, I'll be finished just as Dread comes out, and that'll be the next game I play after that's done. And then, uh, once that's done, uh, we'll be spending some time going back and finishing up games that I never started or have, are in the middle of. Uh, Fuga, Neo World Ends With You, No More Heroes 3. Again, I don't know if I'm gonna have time to do all of it, but I'm gonna try. I think after Metroid Dread, the next game coming out for me is, uh, Pokemon. So I have, like, a month and a half to, to work through other stuff. Hopefully I won't blow it. But anyway... That's it for me tonight. Uh, if you want to watch more streams, check out twitch.tv slash 
Twitch.tv. Whoa. Whoa. What is wrong with me? Check out Twitch.tv slash team slash Wild Abandon. Plenty of people streaming there right now. Uh, my auto host will take you to one of them once I go offline. Actually, you know what? I have, a, I have a few people here. Let's raid. Let's raid someone on the team. Because it is a good night for that. But yeah. Stick around. I'll be raiding someone from Team Wild Abandon. You all have a great night, and I will see you tomorrow. Good night.